Finish him. Oh, why are you always gonna beat me? <laughs> Roar some lava line. Why are you always gonna beat me? Because it's fun. I know, but you should let me win sometimes. You stink. I'm beating you. Oh, 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 oh. You guys, look at these pages. Look how old these pages oh are. This is like back when Grandma was born. This is. It even smells old. I oh. thought you were laughing at the pages at first. <laughs> this is so cool. We should, you know, what we should do. We should take this to a historian and see if it's worth anything. Ooh. No, hey, Laura, what are you down. doing? Let hey, go. Calm down. What's your problem? Yeah, what's the? You let the attitude stuff like this. Why are yeah, you being what's, so what's mean? It? Yeah, what's what's the attitude? Do whatever you want. Whatever you want. to defeat her. You think the doll maker doesn't want us to know about this? Yeah. But wait, but there's nothing written on any of these pages. Mm -hmm. So why don't I understand how it could be a threat to her? Like I think that in one of those pages there's a, you need a black light board. <gasps> that is slicker than slickness. Remember we did that lotion thing that made, that made us see on our hands? Yeah, that made us see the germs on our hands? Yeah, maybe we use that black light. On the pages? Ooh. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to look into that because I don't know if they like, this is a really old book and I don't know if they had like that kind of ink back then. So I'm going to do some research. There could be some kind of encryption. Sometimes you right. need like a blow dryer, a hair dryer. Remember in that movie, National Treasure? I was just going to say, we saw a movie where they used lemon juice and a blow dryer to detect a treasure map that was on the back of the Declaration of Independence. Yeah, with National Treasure. So maybe we should... I'm gonna look into that and see if that's actually possible. But look at these pages, you guys. Do we have any lemons? I'll squeeze them now. <laughs> look at these pages. Like these are really, really old pages and really old leather. So, like I, this there is... are some abnormalities on the pages. That's interesting. Yeah, there's like there's like water spots on them and stuff. Um, yeah, they're like, great. Like yeah. look at this. Like you see this big circle here. Yeah. Maybe. So sure. See, so he's like. Uh, um, like, so you can see these big, there's lighter here. Yeah, yeah. I, I think I know something. Maybe we should have a black light there. That's a good thinking. Yeah, so there could be some sort of secret ink on here, and maybe with Aurora being controlled by the doll maker, maybe there's something that the doll maker knows about this that we don't. This house is really old. It was built in the 1920s, so it is possible that somebody who lived here back then you know, tucked it away or something, but we've lived here for almost 10 years and we've cleaned that vent so many times I would think that we would have found this by now. That's true. So, all right. Um, have you ever seen that book before? No. no. No, me neither. So Daniel, why don't you go get ready for bed and I will come up and tuck you in in a few minutes. Okay? Good night, Dongle. Good night. Okay. Mwah. So, I didn't want to say anything in front of Daniel, but I'm a little concerned because I've been doing some research and when somebody's controlled by the doll maker, um, they start to turn family members into dolls. What? Yeah. And I, I know Daniel's been really scared of the doll maker and like been having nightmares about the doll maker. So I, we need to really keep a very close eye on Aurora and I'm hoping that something to do with this book can help us stop the doll maker because I don't want you guys or me to be turned into a doll. That would be unfortunate. I would rather not. No. <laughs> this is not guys and dolls. I don't. <laughs> Hello, Mom. Hello, little brother. What do you want? Is there any way to talk to your big sister? You've been really mean to everybody lately. I don't know why mom's so obsessed with that stupid book. And why do you even care about it? They're making her angry. Who angry? You asked for it.
Hey, <laughs> woman, you little brother. I'm gonna have to do some research on this book and see what I can find out and see if maybe there's a way to defeat the doll maker. In the meantime, we need to keep an eye on Aurora. And that book, you need to put that book somewhere and, she yeah, can't get well, it. Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hide this book somewhere. I'm not going to let our friends at home know where it is in case the doll maker watches the video. I don't want her to know where it is. Um, just be very careful around her. Don't do anything to upset her. I know she's had a, quite a bit of an attitude lately, but the only reason I haven't really gotten on her case for it is because I don't want to be turned into a doll. Because <laughs> yes. then there's nothing I can do at that point. All right, so let's. I'm gonna go up and tuck in Daniel. Okay. And Aurora, and uh, get ready to head to bed. Okay. Okay. Hey, Aurora. I just wanted to say good night and sweet dreams. Good night, mother. Um. Good night. What? Nothing. Yeah. I love you. Dongle, I'm here to check, tuck you in. Dongle? Never seen this before. Dongle, where are you? I'm here, Mom. It's not time for hide and seek. Come out, it's time for bed. The doll mommy. What did you say? Dongle, is that really you? Mommy, she told me. What? What is it? She turned him into a doll! What?